Hi guys, welcome to Pissport Productions. Uh, this started off doing a Cantonese lemon chicken, but Karen doesn't like chilli. So. I do like chilli, but I can't have it. Yeah, so we've changed it a little bit. So it's now going to be garlic and lemon chicken. So it's not Cantonese, it's garlic. Anyway, it's dead easy. You can do it Cantonese if you want, but the, uh, the ingredients is one level teaspoon of uh, sweetener granules, and we use that stuff. Uh, a juice of a lemon, 300 ml of hot chicken stock. We're actually using 250 because we tend to get a bit too Which watery. Over there, and the lemon Which is over there. there. There's lemon. Um, two tablespoons of soy sauce. Uh, four. That's a dark one, but they say light, but they're the, they're the same anyway. Um, four skinless and boneless chicken breast cut into bite sized chunks, which is in there and a level tablespoon of corn flour and you put that in there and then mix the chicken in there so it coats the chicken so that's already done uh three medium carrots which is in there julienne uh they're julienne uh red chili which we're not using but we're using garlic and i like it chunky uh sugar snap peas which are there they go in a bit later on and two spring onions uh shredded to serve and basically Bun this, we, we use a wok, so we're going to put that in there. And I'm coming over. Okay, you, I bet, did you get your thingies out? What things? That thingy. That thingy, yep. The pan is a bit hot, so... Well, that's how you want it to seal it, though. I mean, the, it says medium heat, but in a, with a wok, it, you can't do medium, it needs to be hot. So it's, it's sealing quite nice. And oh, we've got, and the, next to it is a pan of leek, cabbage, and carrot. Have with it. And in the microwave, we've got some microwave um, rice as well. So that'll be a nice meal. That's been sealed quite nice. Just keep turning it so that you've got no pink bits on the chicken. The rest of it will cook while we're doing the rest. Yeah, because in a minute we'll do the um, the sauce. And it's quite loud because obviously it's quite hot. This is cooking quite nice actually. Another couple of turns, I reckon. Yep, I reckon so. Because then you find these bits that haven't turned. Right, while that's in there doing that, let's do the... I'm coming back, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Let's do the mix. Oh, there's a cat in the way. Let's do the sauce mix. Right. And basically, mix. One level teaspoon of this sweetener. So that's half a sin. And that is a teaspoon, isn't it? And hot and so it has got a few sins in it. Yeah, but it's divided by four people, yeah. so it's actually not too bad. It's saying the corn flour and the sweetener you have to sin. Yeah. So two tablespoons of soya, so to give it a nice a nice kick. That's that. Stir it. And then the lemon. Pour all that in there. Just stir it, because that's going to go in that in a minute. And then you can put your garlic and your... No, the garlic goes in at the end. Well, it's alright, okay. And the carrots? I'll tell you in a minute. We don't go in just yet. That's still cooking. And going by this, um, we've got to fry the chicken over until it starts to crisp up on the edges, then add the carrots and a little bit of chopped chilli. So we can put a few garlic, garlic in. in. Or we can put some lazy garlic in. 
and leave that until the end because you've got to sprinkle it on top. <laughs> well, I'd, I'd rather the garlic cooks a bit more beef. Oh, I can do that. I'm, <laughs> that's not a problem. I'll stick the garlic in with the carrots to flavour it up. Okay. Okay, just let that. Now I'm going to come over there because you're going to be adding bits. Nice, yeah. Well, I'm going to come over because I'm, we're adding bits now. Right. That's our son just come That's in for work. <clears throat> well, that's looking good. Okay. Add the carrots so they can go in. And then mix in nice. And we can put the garlic on top. I reckon there. garlic, yeah. We'll put the garlic on top. All of it? All of it. We'll do all of it. Because you know flavour and that from the other going in. I like me garlic. Just keep turning it. And that's it's a whole scary. bulb of garlic that's gone in there. There'll be no vampires at your door tonight. No, and it's speed food. And that's like that. Pour the sauce on top to let it simmer. Yeah, it's good mixing first. It's, yeah. it's mixing in. The whole lot is going to be coated. This is going to be quite nice, I think. Mm -hmm. Smelling nice already. That's all we need to do. Just let that sit out of these on top and let the whole lot cook. Right. We, we like sugar snacks. Just mix them in. And it softens them up and then we'll come back to you when we dish it up. That'll be quite nice I think. Mm. Um, and it, it's, it really is as simple as that. So simple I can do it. So we like chicken anyway. And we like garlic and we like vegetables. So this is a perfect mix. So you've got speed. The only thing that you've got to sin really it's is the corn flour. The corn flour. And the sweetener. And the sweetener. But like I say, it's um, dish to four people. So um, the sins aren't that great. And it's a nice, comfortable meal. Well, we hope it is anyway. Oh, it we'll smells nice. It is smelling rather nice. So we'll, oh, we'll, catch, you, we'll catch you in a little while. And so uh, catch you in a little bit. See you in a bit. Hello. Hi, welcome back. These have been in for a little while now. They've been simmering quite nicely. This is spring onion, and all we're doing is just putting that on top. We don't want it too crunchy. And we can mix that in. The carrot's a little bit softer now. The um, sugar snap peas are just about right. We've got a spring onion in there now. And we've got some vegetables as well, and I think that is going to be quite nice. We've got some vegetables, we've got some microwave rice going on in there. And again, this is supposed to be for four people, so... Yeah, and again, the microwave rice we're using, you have to sin. Yeah, so, I'll tell you. But that's going to be between four of us, so... Probably won't need this now, so that can go into there. You want your dishy wrapper now, don't you? It does. And we're going to turn that off, because we'll do the bench. Let's just tip the water out for the potato and then that can be dished up. You can see it's bubbling away quite nicely. Now, it makes a change for having a meal like this. Mm -hmm. 
That's there in the present position, huh? And we'll be lifting this up now, I think. But, but I think that'll be more than enough. You want that? No, I've got one over Alright, you've got one, huh? I've got you one. You beat me to it then? Oh, yeah. huh? oh, there's a cat in the way. I'm just moving him out of the way of my foot slightly. You got enough for a pot and all, haven't you? We have. There's enough there to make another one. Let's try and get a bit more chicken for Jamie. There's enough there to make another pot, so I'll put that on there out of the way. You can save some of the vegetables to put in with that as well if you want. There's there. And as you can tell, I'll get a bit sloppy when it comes to dishing up. And if you do too much veg, you can always leave it and do a... Um, bubble and squeak. Bubble and squeak in the morning. Is it the rice? Good old Uncle Ben's. Do that's one, I think it's two sins per packet, that one. So that's going to be there. between... A little bit there. And that's it, and that's your meal. Uh, it all looks very nice. And it's very, very filling. So that'll do me. I'm happy with that. Okay, we so shall. This is probably a boring video compared to what we normally do, but it is really, really nice. I'll put the recipe up afterwards and uh, enjoy. We'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Bye.